In May 2001, in Leesburg, Virginia, the East Coast rapist would strike once again, this time in an apartment complex where he grabbed a woman from behind, wrapping his arms around her. Now, this woman thought at first it was her husband and kind of laughed it off. But when she looked down, she saw the arms didn't belong to her husband. The man told her to shut up or that he would kill her, telling her he had a knife. Now, the 41-year-old woman had been in the process of moving out of her apartment, so she was walking back and forth from the apartment to her car. And around 5 p.m., she had sent her son off to take his weekly Taekwondo lesson while she finished up moving. And while she had been down at her car on one of her various trips, the rapist had taken the opportunity to enter the nearly empty apartment. So when she returned into the apartment, not knowing he had slipped in there, that's when he grabbed her from behind and he pushed her onto the bedroom floor. What the victim saw was not a knife, though, but an orange-handled Phillips-head screwdriver.